Hey everybody, how's it going? I'm Seth and welcome back to another video guide for Cyberpunk 2077. In this video, folks, I'm going to be showing you how to get the legendary badge armor set. So that is the police armor set. Now, the very first place that we want to be is here on the map. So we are in Santo Domingo and this is my location right here. So this is where you want to come and then we're going to make our way to towards the very first piece of this armor set however do bear in mind that one or two pieces of this armor set i have already picked up so the dead bodies that we're looking for of course will not be there but this is where i am currently located i will show you the locations of those uh, armor pieces so we're going to go into that direction we will see some cars and what looks like uh, the aftermath of a battle scene so we can see right there that we've got a little legendary icon we've got another one right here and it does appear like we are able to pick up two of the same pieces from this location so might as well pick them up this is actually quite good so this is of course the coat so we can see this right here it is the heavy duty reinforced badged coat so that's one piece right there now of course if you're not happy with the mod slots you can always save here and then reload again for something different uh they do come with a variety of uh, options in terms or number of uh, armor mod slots. And this is what it looks like, unfortunately, or luckily for me, actually, it came with four mod slots. So that's quite good. Of course, we've got some more lootable items right here. As you can see, we've got the gun and we have another coat right here. This one has three mod slots. So this is the location for the coat now i'm gonna go on to the next location when i get there i will cut back in and i will show you where to go so here we are for the second location i'm gonna get out the car i'm gonna show you on the map and this is where we are right here so we're gonna go onto this building and there we will find the next piece of the set we are of course still in santo domingo and we're basically in this corner right here of the map this is where you want to be over here there is also a quest for a free bike that you can get if you're interested in that i do have a video for that we're going to go up the stairs we're going to continue going up the stairs and in no time we're going to go up this ladder we will see the armor set this is a bit uh dodgy so again as you can see we have two legendary items right there according to this and we get let's have a look over here the boots so the waterproof badge combat boots now of course same thing over here if you're not happy with the amount of um mod slots save before you loot and then reload that save to get more mod slots so this is the location right here but right next to me right behind me there's another thing that we can pick up and it is going to be a copy of the same boot now you can break a pair down should you choose to and you can get these fairly early on in the game and if you break down a pair you will get of course the legendary component and then you can use the glitch method to duplicate them that i have shown on the channel and so that way you can have access to legendary components early on it is very unlikely that you will get both pairs of boots with the maximum mod slots on them so I would probably break down one of these boots and then get the components from them and then dupe them at a drop box. So that's what the boots look like. We're going to carry on with the next piece of this armor. This is where you want to come for the next piece of the armor. This is the closest or these are the closest uh, fast travel points. We are, as you can see on the map right here. So this is in Watson. And funny enough is the next piece after this is also in Watson. It's actually close to an area where I like to go and farm XP early on to level up quickly. So we're going to go down this street right here. So what you want to do is you want to kind of jump over this bridge, this um, fence right here. You can come down these steps if you want to. I just forgot to come down the steps. So right here we will find a dead cop and he will have the anti-puncture nail attack pants with composite lining so this is part of the badge armor set we'll pick that up 
remember to i'm just going to pick it up for this video but remember to save before you pick up if you don't get the maximum amount of mod slots on it and just keep loading until you get what you want so let's put these on and see what they look like there we go so as you can see it is part of the set so next piece up we're going to go for the glasses which i am currently wearing but i will be showing you the location for this now this is something that i picked up fairly early in the game because that is an area that i did go to farm and eventually kind of wandered in and found the dead cop that had the glasses picked them up and i've had them for a very long time in this gameplay so you will not see the body and the damage and the carnage that is going to be there if you haven't been there already all right here we are with the next location again we are in watson and as you can see i'm going to zoom in and there is a fast travel point right next to me so you can use this and right behind me because i'm facing basically towards the according to this towards the fast travel point basically that's the fast travel point right there we're going to go through this way now there are two groups of enemies here that you can farm 4xp there's also a cyber psycho in this area so do bear that in mind we're going to try and avoid any combat so we'll go around this vehicle uh, i did see something there anywho let's keep going and over here you'll see a group of people just partying so behind me so that's the second group right there that i was just looking at over here we get this group of people just partying they won't mind us they as long as we don't annoy them the people here won't really have any issue with this right here at this end where you see the blood splatters there's a vehicle and some dead bodies one of them will be a cop and one of them of course the cop will have the glasses so so i'm already wearing them and i have leveled them up and stuff like that so they do have quite a decent amount of armor this is something that you can do so you can pick them up early on some of them do have a level requirement so do bear that in mind and of course you can see they do have a decent amount of armor but that is because i have been leveling them up i did uh, get them quite early in the game and they kind of helped me with my armor rating in the game which is why i invested so much in these glasses so this is what this armor set looks like. I do hope that you have enjoyed this video and found it useful and informative. If you have, please don't forget to support me and the channel by hitting that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you are new and haven't already for more similar content from myself. And if you have just subscribed, why not check out some of my other videos and guides here on this channel. Who knows, you might just enjoy them. And don't forget to hit that bell icon so that you get notified when I upload new videos and content to the channel. Also, for those interested, you can always find me on the Sathtopia Discord. Links to this, of course, you can find down below in the video's description. And until next time, stay safe, folks.